All right, so I got my package of the gas lens kit from the uh, Amazon called RX Welder or whatever. Came pretty quick. Um, came sooner than it was supposed to. So um, this is a Weldcraft uh, WP-17V, which means it has a valve. So here is our um, camera focus. Or 330 seconds gas lens and their cap on the back. And so I discovered something interesting about these. So here's my old one and um, call it body. Um, they, they sell these things and they say like small, medium, large. And I didn't really understand what they were talking about, but. Basically, you go ahead and look at this one, and they give you the regular ones, but they're short, um, real short, and so they have the same thread here, but they don't have the same thread there, so you have to use these cups with their stuff, and you cannot use your other cups from wherever. So, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing or not. They don't seem to want to thread real easily either. Oh, this one here is kind of janky. So, that's their number eight. And this is my number eight that I use. I just wanted the gas lenses. And I don't really actually want the alumina cups, but um, um, what I wanted was these clear Pyrex glass lens, glass, so I could see my my arc. So, anyways, um, um, that part fits so far, and then um, I mean, twenty six dollars. I went to the welding supply place. And for a 330 seconds gas lens, they wanted, uh, you know, um, the one place wanted like $8 for one lens. The other place wanted $27 for one lens. And it depended on the size. But here you get, um, you get all of them. Um, there's an eighth, uh, one and sixteenth. And then the, uh, well, I don't know what it is. The one millimeter. I don't know what it is. It's really small. So you get some other stuff in here. So you've got the aluminum nozzles for the standard. And then you've got the ones that fit the gas lenses. And then if you don't like those, then you could use these ones. So what I'm going to use is the glass ones. So let's go ahead and take one of those out. And, uh, try and do this one-handed while I hold the camera. So... Just supposed to be like some kind of Pyrex or whatever. So, and then you have to put the O rings on your lens to get that to work. So, I'm gonna do that, but I'm gonna have to pause the video. So, I'm not 100% sure why they got these two different O rings or how many they want you to use or whatnot, but I went ahead and used the green one. And um, I think on their ad. On Amazon, they show more than one. I just put it on there like that for now. Because uh, I'll go and look it up later. But anyway, um, I will make another video when I figure out how well these actually work. And um, so stay tuned and uh, subscribe. Thanks for watching.